Welcome to Ask Allie and Alyssa, where you ask the questions and we answer them thoroughly. This week's topic has been requested by one of our regular viewers here in our studio town of Roseburg, Oregon. Ben Swanson asked us, how can I make a Twinkie at home? Well, we brought him here so he could have a first-hand experience of how to make a Twinkie. So get out your bowl. Mixers and spatula, cause we're, we're gonna, gonna whip up some Twinkies. Twinkies. Oh yeah. Here comes Ben now. You want to make Let's jump in the room. We're making Twinkies in the wood. Nice. Yeah. Okay, so the first step into making our Twinkies is to, or the Twinkie cake, is to cream one cup of butter and two cups of sugar until they are smoothly, nice and smoothly mixed. Make sure your butter is at nice room temperature for an easy mixing. Now we're going to add one and a half cups of milk to our creamed butter and sugar. And four, egg, four eggs and two egg yolks and four teaspoons of vanilla and we're going to mix this thoroughly with the creamed butter and sugar and now we're going to add our dry ingredients this is a mixture of three cups of flour one teaspoon of salt and two teaspoons of baking powder powder not soda there is a difference most of the time you find your baking soda in the fridge, not always, but sometimes. Now we're going to add this dry ingredient mixture a little at a time, just a little bit at a time, so that it doesn't like fly everywhere. Just a little at a time. Now that our batter is prepared, we can put our mixture away. Prepared batter, very nice. So, we're going to pour some batter, three-fourths uh, fill each thing three fourths full so that it doesn't overflow. And this is a special pan, special Twinkie pan that you can get in this big set that you can probably buy on eBay or any major re online super store. So we're going to fill this like three fourths of the way full with the Twinkie batter so that it gets all nice and in there. Try not to get it on the sides of the pan. That is fine. Look at that. And now you just do that for the rest of the pan until there's no more batter left. Now that they're all in the pan, we're going to stick it in a preheated 350 degree oven for 15 minutes or until the top is a nice golden brown. Then we're going to take our Twinkie batter and we're going to put it in the oven for 15 minutes. Or until the top is a nice golden brown and the toothpick that you stick in the middle comes out nice and heavy. Well, hi, Ben. Are you ready to make the filling for the Twinkies? Yes. Alrighty, well, first we have two sticks of butter. We also have two cups of powdered sugar and two cups of marshmallow and two teaspoons of vanilla. Once that is all in the bowl, we will mix it with the wonderful and good old fashioned mixer. Now that we are finished with our wonderful filling, we are going, oh yes, and it looks like the Twinkies are just about done. Oh my gosh, the Twinkies are almost done. All we have to do is take them out of the oven and fill them up. So get your oven mitts safety first and take your done Twinkies. Man, they look beautiful. I don't know. Okay, set them on top of the stove and then we're going to let them cool for 15 minutes and we'll be right back once they're cool. Now that we have finished our Twinkies and they are cooled, we can inject them with the injector. This, can, this comes in the Twinkie Bake Kit or you can probably find one at any convenient local grocery store. So, first, you pick up a Twinkie, turn it over, and inject one in the middle. And you squeeze with the injector. Then you do it again in three 
of, or two other places. And voila, there you have it. A yummy twin. So, Lindsay, how did you like your Twinkie? It's heavenly. Emily, give us your opinion about the delicious Twinkie that you're holding. Mmm. Okay, I guess that says it all. And now, for the opinion that matters the most. Ben. Was your Twinkie good? It was good. Oh, it was That's so all, good. That's folks. Mm.